Finance Minister Nirmala Sitaraman announced in her Budget 2022 speech that the Reserve Bank of India will introduce its own digital currency this year called Digital Rupee. The new currency will compete with Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies with a guarantee provided by none other than the RBI itself. Here's a look at the Apex Bank's new move and how it is expected to boost India's digital economy. Nirmala Sitaraman said that the digital rupee or central bank digital currency will work using blockchain and other technologies and will lead to a more efficient and cheaper currency management system. The RBI defines it as a legal tender issued by the bank in a digital form. In simple words, it is a digital form of the Indian rupee, thus exchangeable with the fiat currency. The digital currency will have an advantage over currency notes in a sense that it will come with an indefinite validity since digital currency can never be torn, burnt, physically damaged or lost. Other benefits include quick transactions and accessibility in remote areas of the country. By promoting a digital currency, the government will not only save on printing expenses but also minimize the risk associated with the cryptocurrency since the digital rupee will be regulated by India's Apex Bank. Blockchain technology is by nature decentralized, which means that all its data is stored across a network of computers. This increases its resilience to computer errors and cyber threats. But the digital rupee will not be truly decentralized since it will be regulated by a single entity, the RBI, which will control its issuance and distribution. The RBI will, however, have to set up this network, which will be limited to the bank and associated entities. In modern economies, the government had on many occasions before flagged concerns about other private cryptocurrencies, fearing its use in money laundering, terror financing and tax evasion. In response, it announced its own digital currency. Although a formal announcement by the RBI about the digital currency and its use is yet to come, one thing is clear. Digital rupee transactions would be instantaneous as compared to present digital payments. An RBI report had earlier said its digital currency will be a safe, robust and convenient alternative to physical cash, which can also assume the complex form of a financial instrument. Currently, nine countries have fully launched their own digital currency, while 14 others have reached the pilot stage and are preparing a possible full launch soon. The shift to digital currency can offer benefits to users in terms of liquidity, scalability, acceptance, ease of transactions with anonymity and faster settlement. This is also a part of the government's move to shift to a cashless economy and will further ease cross-border remittances. A federal report.